You okay? Yeah, I'm fine, mate. Don't worry about it. You all right? Enjoy your life. Hey guys, Brett and Millimeter USA here, and this video is going to be on the HK USP 45, the legendary HK USP 45. A lot of people love this pistol. This pistol is very much so world renowned as far as HK quality and just the shootability. This pistol is supposedly amazing. This is going to be our first experience with an HK USP style pistol. Uh, Brett is here and I shot a newer rendition of an HK product, the HK 45. So the newer uh, iteration from HK as far as a 45 ACP double action single action handgun recently uh, that my brother picked up. And that was a really good pistol. I think that this pistol overall because of its uh, service history and just the uh, classicness of it you might say it's a better pistol it also feels better in the hand and it carries two more rounds say 12 plus one capacity on this pistol a 45 ACP this pistol has been in so many movies man the 9 millimeter variant was in heat the 45 ACP variant just like this was in collateral Tom Cruise was using it as the hitman named Vincent and oh my god, that movie is amazing. Both those movies, Heat and Collateral, were directed by Michael Mann. <laughs> that dude just knows how to make a good movie. Definitely nothing around here. Oh no! Shit! Fuck! My man, you alright? Fuck. Hey, he, 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 he fell on the cab. Oh, shit. I think he's dead. Good guess. You killed him? No, I shot him. Bullets in the fall killed him. Red light, Max. Hold on, hold on. Red light, Max! All right, here we go. First shots here. Start from double action first round. You see this version here has uh, the uh, Mepro Light True Dot Night Sights on it. Here we go. Double action first round. Very smooth. That's so smooth. Look at that group too. Jesus. This gun just shoots so good. This nice. is a uh, combat handgun, if I've ever seen one. Just amazing. Impressive. Very, very impressive. Brett is here. You need to see what you think of your new handgun here. Impressive so far. Not one hiccup. I'm up next, guys. All right, what you got there, Brett here? Okay, I've got the HK USP and 45 ACP. I've been looking forward to this for a long time. I was able to get one with night sights. If I remember back when they used to come back from Germany, um, they did not have night sights on them because I think Germany made night sights illegal. Anyway, um, now that they're here in the States, um, night sights seem to be no problem whatsoever. We are 16 yards away from our target. The green and the black one are 16 yards away. And then the target behind you, the small one, is yep. about 20 yards away. So just so you guys know how far we're shooting today. And i uh, been looking forward to this, so this should be a lot of fun. 45 ACP. The first thing I noticed playing with the gun is it is quite easy to rack. Uh, with the hammer down and the slight serrations back here do help in racking the pistol I did try to grab it up here once and kind of slid off it a little bit so there's nothing going on up here and you got serrations back here so overhand method probably your friend and it's very easy so anyway a lot of things about this pistol that was developed many many years ago 
and as you said earlier, Young Beretta is quite legendary in its own right. Has a lot of nice things about it. One last thing. So here we are, we're hot right here. Can't see the, I'll go ahead and turn this way because this is safe. Right here is a decocker. And so you just pull it down and it goes from safe fire mode down to decock and then it goes back up and you're right back in fire mode. If you want to go to safe, safety or put it in safe, you push up. And you can also go cocked and locked with this because of that feature. Yeah, absolutely. Yeah. Sure. Okay, so let's see how it shoots. The trigger is, is heavy, but it's very smooth. And because it's smooth, that double action shot is quite easy to hit from 16, 17 yards away. got to make sure you align the sights. If you dip that front end, the rounds are going to land short. I'm going to try three straight ahead, one-handed, and then we'll go to the kneeling 20 yards away that way. Let's do three this way. You're just hammering on the trigger, I think, a little too much. I think so too. Yeah. Uh, these are hollow points, federal. Yeah, you just gotta take your time a little bit. Double strike. Okay, that round didn't go Fair off. Fair to fire. It's an old round. Old round failed to fire. Double action only, or double action on this shot. Those are some really old rounds. Yep. Okay. Those are those super old rounds that were in that bag and they are not firing. So the hollow points fired, the federal hollow points that were really old, they fired. But these have a very good hit on them. I found this little baggie of rounds that were 45 ACP. You can see the hit on the round itself, but it failed to go off. And there's a couple of them. Okay, and so the reason we'll why you were shooting ammo. And so the reason why you were shooting those was because, you know, those were just laying around. You just wanted to get rid of them finally. Right. So those were old carry rounds as far as the federal from your department way back. Yeah, I don't know where it came from. Um, it had been around for, obviously, in a bag, plastic baggie for a long time. And I just thought we'd fire them. But even though the HK is hitting them pretty hard and putting a good dent in them, they're not going off. Yeah. So we'll go back to SIG ammo right now. The ammo is supplied by Elite Performance Ammunition from SIG Sauer. This is their 45 ACP ammo, 230 grain, traveling at 850 feet per second and 369 foot pounds. One thing about it, if you guys know this HK USP 45 at all, you should have known this is coming. Hey homie, is that my briefcase? Put it down. Red light, Max. Yo, homie. 
that my briefcase? Is it your briefcase? Yeah, it is. Why? You want it back? I want your wallet. What else you got for me? Huh? Red light, Max. Don't move. All right, so here we go. 45 ACP, 12 rounds. See how this thing feels from double action again. It's so Man down. Just very smooth. It's one of the smoothest shooting 45s I've ever shot, aside from a 1911 with an all steel frame, of course. It's way smoother than a Glock 21 or a PPQ 45. It's, it's amazing. Double action first round, single hand. Jerk that one. Last mag here. Here we go. You shoot it really well, man. Yep. Yeah. Well, I mean, hell, Jack Bauer shot the 9 mil real good in 24. Yeah. <laughs> So Young Brun and I were just talking about it at the table. You guys may know I am a huge Glock 21 fan. And uh, Young Brother was saying this HK is a lot better than any Glock 21 he's ever fired. I don't know if I quite agree with that, but I will tell you I am very pleasantly surprised at how good this pistol is. Hey man, it's just more of that, you know, space crowd magic. <laughs> HK. They know how to make a gun. They really do. Yeah. You know? It's outstanding. Yeah. So I don't know, maybe that means there'll be a future 9mm or 40 caliber for us sure. in HK. I hope so. All right, more shooting to come. The table towards the back is where he hangs. Clean shot. Watch your back. Watch your back.
That completes the HK USP 45 guys. Fantastic, not one malfunction. Absolutely love it. For my first HK USP, uh, nothing not to love here. If you guys do not have one and you thought, you know, it's kind of an old gun, not really interested in it, doesn't bring a whole lot to the table, it is a ton of fun, a total 10 as far as performance, feel, shootability, and the way the gun is made. So if you know anything about these German guns, and the price has come down from the way it was priced a year or two years ago, the price has come down in my area over $200. So look for these somewhere in the upper eights to lower nines with night sights. And three mags. Yeah, it came with three mags too. And the magazines are phenomenal. And I know they're expensive, guys, to buy as an individual piece. But the magazines are phenomenal. Very well made. It says made in Germany in big letters right there. So again, like many things in life, you get what you pay for. And in this case, you really get what you pay for. It is a terrific pistol. Thanks for watching the video, guys. Remember to like, share, and subscribe to our channel here on YouTube, Red and 9mm USA. And remember, your Second Amendment is worth protecting.